This will be the video that I will dedicate to Slovenian Prime Minister Robert Golob and my father, uh, age 91, laying on a dead bed, thanks to, well, foremost Slovenian government. He is not in Britain. He is not in Germany. He is not in the United States of America. It is a Slovenian police. It is a Slovenian government who wants him dead. Uh, basically, the story is really short. All I got to do is point this individual out so that you will understand really who this guy is. He is now a Slovenian prime minister. This is a schoolmate of Borut Pahor. I have already dedicated one already some attention to. Uh, this individual was involved in genocide against me since 1990. That's since 33 years ago. Uh, I'm sure that you are familiarized with this individual here. Do you know this individual here? Who doesn't know him? He's a good friend of Vladimir Putin. He's a good friend. This is not so that I would defend uh, opposition of these people because we don't have any. We have a lot of traitors inside of the country. Uh, we don't actually have any kind of opposition. We don't have any opposition of any kind. We don't have any people. We have people that have worked for them all along, uh, pretending to be something else and this and that. I don't want to give uh, credibility uh, to the people that went ahead and even exposed themselves as uh, corrupt and so on, so that those other people would not have a problem enforcing their views and so on. I wouldn't go and do this kind of stuff, but this really is a politic of Milan Kuchan, a very good friend of uh, Vladimir Putin, this man here, you know, everybody knows this man. Who doesn't know this guy here? He has got everything to do with the world, the way it's shaped for the last 33 years. Every fucking war, everything you have seen, bloodshed. This guy has got a lot, a lot, a lot to do with it. And he always had a lot to say everywhere. This is a number one Slovenian man, a politician from Slovenia who cooked the war and in Chechnya and in Bosnia, actually on Balkans, and now the one you see on Ukraine and so on. This is a very good assistance of the man you see right there. This is a jump starter of Vladimir Putin in Slovenia. This is the number one man who did all this stuff. This is, like I said, Slovenia is a state that is completely without any kind of statehood. Slovenia is engaging in a practice for which they have decided will enforce against all human regulations, rules, statutes, international laws, treaties, so that Russian politics would become so dominant together with British royals. Uh, and of course, what we have going on also throughout the United States of America in this world. Yeah, they, they are going to they are pushing forward the new agenda, the new way of everything. And these are basically the people that took the lead. Yes. Uh, Robert Golob stated me, uh, this is just in respect to my father, so that you're going to know that you will understand how much the human sanity can be fucked, exploited, pushed on the edge, over the edge and how dangerous this individual is. This individual stated he's going to murder my father at all the costs. I'm going to repeat you his words to me there in MKUltra. Father has to be murdered. There is no other way than father to be murdered. He would, will, if I say, if I repeat his words, I will murder one regardless. I will get one murdered regardless. Because you will be talking against the British and to support your claims, the death of father will be necessary. But there was a pre-clause, something that followed before what I stated, which was that he would award one with a death certificate, uh, that he would have one disappear, rather, so that... British would feel more guilty and they video recorded themselves next to me 
saying this stuff to me. And then he went back to the old stuff, uh, to the stuff I have just a little earlier stated, that no matter what, he will get my father murdered. And for murdering my father, he named as the main cause so that he could damage British. The thing is that this is a hiring. This is a killer for hire. This was the employee of the British because the British and the Russians work together 100% hand in hand. This is the man, the most corrupt, the most criminal assassin killer. This is the man who murdered a lot of people. This is the man who got my father on a deathbed. And this guy is obligated to murder my father. This is a fanatic behind the death of my father, if my father is still alive. This is the guy who pushed forward issue of the British while he was employed by the British since 1990 through Vladimir Putin on behalf of people I demonstrated. I'm not going to be arguing here why my father was killed. Uh, I am just, I just want you to understand that this is the man who rationalized me a further uh, a future murder assassination of my father through exactly what I stated. It's sad, it's pathetic that my father had found himself on a deathbed at age 91 yet again. They had him like this during MK Ultra already three times at the hospitals at least in a home also for elderly people. You can't do stuff like this at the hospital alone. Uh, where they would bring me to his bed to do this stuff. And at age 91, yet again, he found himself on a dead bed, deciding about his life, actually about his assassination, about his death, butchery, by the man, as you see right there, who already promised me that regardless of what, these people claim they, they will ne you're never going to get me. You're never going to get me. It was always identity in another country. Identity this, this. Uh, during MKUltra, it appeared that reality that is pertaining to people, there was no such thing when it came to him. It became evident that this individual was Certain, he was like possessed with something. Certain, self-assured that law cannot come to him anywhere near for doing such action. Because of the degree of crime which elites have pledged against me. So, I just want to clarify this issue. Uh, this individual was elected, selected to get my father murdered, to take initiative in a murder of my father. Number one, I am going to repeat to you. They weren't sure whether they would award one with a death certificate and this and that. And the secondary, the death certificate uh, and what they insisted to me that it would be used for me to extort British. This guy would love nothing more than to throw himself under the train for the British. They exchanged the favors to one another. Whatever these people committed the crime, it was the British royals, it was Prince Charles, Prince William, Prince Harry, Prince Andrew that stormed. They committed themselves to assassination. Remember when they changed the tires on my fucking car? They always covered one another. It doesn't fucking matter. A death is death. A murder is murder. Am I, co am I correct or am I fucking wrong? I am correct about it. And then the story changed that he eventually will get one murdered so that I would have a case against the British if I will be talking about the British. So in other words, he blackmailed me in respect to speech, or I should say genocide with which British enforced against me. So this is the guy I want the police, this individual to be arrested. I want him to be trialed 
I want him to get to the court. I want to get this guy no matter what. Today is May the 31st, 2023. This is the guy I am going to get no matter what.